Well, new tonight, a back of a woman is going the extra mile to help some waterfowl survive during the drought. KCRA3's Claire Dewan introduces us to Mother Goose. During a drought, starving, thirsty birds at Lagoon Valley Park are not a goose to fear. Come on, here they come. At least not for Marcy Gamba. Got a few more to go. <laughs> it's very heart wrenching and it's heartbreaking, and that's what started, you know, our little plight because I was so worried about losing some of them. And so daily, the aptly named Mother Goose. People came by this. I never thought about the water. Fills water bowls and then little swimming pools for her little water fowl. <laughs> so cute. Bringing food and even tiny helpers. Jada, come help me. And then I drive up, they know who I am, and they hear the bag, and they're ready to go. It's our mom. This is all the water that's left in this lagoon at this time of the year. You can see bone dry conditions here. Some say it's because of the drought. The city says this is what happens every year. Um, we have a lot of issues facing our city, but there are folks in our community find this very important. <laughs> it's just kind of indicative of the type of community we live in. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Some of those people don't mind footing the bill for Gamba's feather filled hopes of keeping the 109 birds around. Yes. Oh my gosh. She's counted that. Um, I'm kind of OCD, kind of obsessed. But I come out in the morning with the dogs. I come out around 3 o'clock and then I come out at night and say goodnight to them. And yes, she also knows there's a pond just hundreds of yards away. It was so pleasing to, to me to see how happy they were. Gamba says these are the great great grandchildren of the geese she saw when she brought her 42 year old son here when he was a baby. They still stayed here. This is where they want to be. Makes them very thirsty. And where you'll find Mother Goose until the rain comes. In Vacaville, Claire Duan, KCRA 3 News.